What's going on guys, my name is Carpet Academics and in this video I'm going to show you how to connect a controller to Fortnite on PC. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is actually connect your controller to your PC. You can do this by using the micro USB cable provided with your PS4 or Xbox controller. Now if you don't have one, you can purchase one off Amazon, I'll leave a link in the description below for a quality cable. I don't recommend purchasing a cheap cable from eBay or something. The reason being is because these can actually damage your device or it can at least lower the life expectancy of them. So I'll leave a link in the description for a decent quality cable below. So once you connect the two devices up, you should then see a message come up in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. It's basically saying that it's setting up the controller and making it fully compatible with your device. So it's going to wait until it's uh, set up. Okay, so as you can see at the top here, my wireless controller is set up and ready to go. If you click on this notification, you can also manage your devices here. So if you don't want your wireless controller to be connected for some reason, you can click remove device and then click yes. So once your controller is fully connected, you then want to load up your Fortnite game. So we're going to go ahead and do that now. So when Fortnite is fully loaded up, what you want to do is navigate to the top right hand corner to the main menu. Then you want to click on the cog icon. Once you're here, you then want to navigate to the controller tab. I want to select what controller you're using, whether it's Xbox or PS4 controller. In this case, I'm using a PS4 controller. Then you want to select what sort of um, playing style you want. So personally, I'll use Combat Pro. Then you want to click Apply. So once I've done this, if I just press any button on the controller, as you can see, all of my controls have changed. And now I can actually navigate to the menus using my controller as if I'm playing on a console. If you want to change any of the sensitivity for the controller, you can just scroll all the way across the cogwheel. And if you keep going down, it will say here controller ADS sensitivity and scope sensitivity. You can also change the normal sensitivity. If you do want to start using your keyboard and mouse again, all you need to do is move your mouse about and it will instantly switch back to your keyboard, just like that. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass on to someone who may find it helpful as well. Don't forget to subscribe to see more useful videos like this and thank you for watching.